Okay, here we go. I'm going to take you on a video tour of our home in Cathedral City, which you may be interested in renting for 30 days or more, maybe as much as the full season. Um, I'm starting at the front door and we're looking at the living room right now as if you came through the front door. However, most people use the back door, which you'll see in the tour. But I'm stepping through the front door and this is the living room and a beautiful bank of windows that look out to the golf course. We have a fantastic view of the golf course. It's one of my favorite things about this place. I do love the light and the view that comes in from those windows. If you're familiar with Dade Palm Country Club, that is the eighth uh, tee out there that we're looking at right now. And then you can step closer, look down the course, and there, I don't know if you can see it very well through the screen door, but there's a, a water hazard or a pond out there. That fountain runs all day, about uh, 16, 18 hours a day. It's very nice to hear that sound. There's also a street between us and the golf course, so you will see some traffic. Sometimes it's even heavy. There's a real fireplace, although we only allow Duraflame in there. A uh, big screen TV. I'll step from this side into the kitchen, which we have redone. Re New countertops, although they're just tile. Painted all the pink cabinets, got new appliances. Uh, someday I hope to get new floors, but not in the budget for now. This is a dining, or the actually it's the kitchen nook area. Uh, we don't have big gatherings here, so it's sufficient enough for the small groups that we have. Um, don't have a big dining room table, but something could be arranged if you have Thanksgiving or Christmas here. Turning back again towards the living room and the china hutch, which I spent many hours painting this year. <laughs> again, back, long view from the back to the living room, um, and, and the door that I just came through is left open there. Moving on, we come to the office laundry room, which is more than adequate for keeping up with your emails and uh, checking your messages, Googling and um, surfing the internet. We have a um, front-loading washer-dryer, very nice. Looking back to the kitchen nook, which is the way I came from. And I will say that you have a nice little sitting area there for your computer and printer. However, internet is provided, but not the equipment. No computer, no printer here. You have to bring your own. Should have turned these lights on. Moving down the hallway, this is the guest room. Turn some lights on. Queen size bed not huge but it's very comfortable very good size double closet and directly across the hall from the guest room is the hall bath again not uh, palatial but very comfortable we've just redone the vanities and the floors and the mirrors and the light fixtures they look very nice nice shower no tub, however. Nope, got in the mirror. I didn't want to do that. <laughs> There's our new, new vanities. They're very nice. Very pretty. Moving on, we're heading into the master bedroom, which is very large and comfortable for a manufactured home space. King size bed, king size sleigh bed, which I love. There I am in the mirror again. And small TV in case you want to catch the news before you go to sleep. And I will spin around here. More cabinets that I spent. Linen closet that I spent many hours painting this, this year. Looking back to the guest room. 
or I'm sorry, to the master bedroom. Very nice. Very, very comfortable. I enjoy being here thoroughly. Here is a Jetta tub, if you're interested in that, with a separate shower. And this is the master bathroom, which we also had redone recently. It's, again, very comfortable. And it looks much nicer than it used to with the old pink cabinets and carpet in here. <laughs> Nobody likes carpet in the bathroom. And, of course, the essential commode. Underneath, still more cabinets that I spent painting this year. Looking back into the king-size bed and master bedroom, again, it's just so comfortable. You have everything you need in here. You will want for nothing. Moving back out, we're going back down the hall and turning towards the kitchen nook again to, to show you the real hidden gem in this property. And that is our backyard. Oh, we have covered patio here. I'm moving around. Barbecue for your use. This is what this property is all about. We have covered patio, sunny patio, and lawn. Real grass, completely fenced, perfect for your little dog. We do allow one or two small dogs, no big dogs in the park. And this beautiful tree offers a lot of shade. And it's just, it was the reason we bought this place. I'm gonna move up into the lawn and take a look back at the house so you can get a good idea. There are some roses. There's two lemon trees. And it is just a very comfortable, easy living place. I enjoy it so much. If you are, sorry, there's a big truck going by. If you are interested, please follow the information available with this video. Give me an email or a call and I will get back to you as soon as possible. There's a good chance it is rented. It's pretty popular, so book early. All right, thank you for watching. Best wishes. Bye-bye.